What's up everyone, it's the Gig Guy London and today I want to speak about dropping off packages. Yeah, so sporadically um, during my work um, as an Uber driver um, I'll pull up at the rider location, the pickup location and somebody comes out and they might hand me some keys for example and they're like, oh can you just drop this off and somebody's going to meet you at the other end or they'll have a bag or they'll have um, something like this, you know you know, you might have a, a box and they're like, oh, can you just drop this off to my colleague or to my office or whatever, whatever, whatever. I mean, normally it's cool, you know, so, I mean, you just take it. I mean, it's an easy job, you know, it might be a long distance job and you're just in your car chilling, you're playing your music. You ain't got nobody in the back making no small talk, you know, and you can just be you and just jam and take your own sweet time and get to your destination. Yeah, or you can put your foot down and floor it. I don't know, whatever you want to do, man. There's nobody in your car, you know what I mean? However you drive, whatever your driving style is, man, you get there when you get there, yeah? Okay, now, the only problem with that, yeah? I don't really have a problem taking people's things, yeah? First and foremost, yeah? Because as I said, it's an easy job. I, ain't, I, ain't, I don't really care, you know what I mean? As long as there's somebody meeting me on the other end and I'm not getting to the, to the drop-off destination and, you know I mean, they're expecting me to go up, to, go up like five flights of stairs to some open plan office space and find some girl named Fiona, you know, who's sitting in the back corner somewhere, you know. Meanwhile, my car's double parked, yeah. I ain't got no permit on my car and, I mean, I'm liable to get a ticket, you know. <laughs> so, that's the only thing. When I pick up packages, I'm gonna, I'm gonna want someone to meet me on the other end, yeah. I mean, I'm not walking about or going up in no elevator to the 20th floor to go and deliver something to nobody, yeah. So they better come meet me at, by the car. Yeah, I'm gonna set it down. I mean, right at the drop-off location. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call you and tell you that the package is at the drop-off location. Tell you boy to come get it. Yeah. But more importantly, yeah, in this heightened state of this terror alert and so on and so forth, and all this madness going on and the Manchester bombings and you know what I mean, people doing some madness uh, all around London as well. You know, like stabbing up people and trying to drive over people and. I mean, planting bombs and so on and so forth. The last thing you want as an Uber driver, yeah, or as a private hire driver is to pick up um, a parcel, for example. Like, this is a prime example, yeah? This parcel here, yeah? It's all sealed, yeah? And they're like, ah, oh, you know what? Can you just um, take this to my mate in, like, Canary Wolf? You know, and you're like, yeah, 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 no problem, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean? And you get to Canary Wolf with some parcel. You don't know what's in the parcel, yeah? They've, you know what I mean? They pull it in your vehicle, I don't know what it is, and you go in there, I mean, you're going through security and they're like, what's in the parcel? We're like, don't know, mate, you know? I mean, you hear his tick, 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 tick. I don't even know if bombs sound like anything anyway, but, you know, just be careful, you know? Be careful. I mean, somebody might have some vendetta, you know? It might be a husband delivering something to his ex-wife, you know, and the package explodes with some acid in it or whatever the case is, you know? I mean, or somebody's really got some terror plot, you know? And they got you being host, you know, taking it all the way there. You know what I mean? Like, normally when, I, when I'm when i delivering something, yeah, when somebody comes now, I'll let them put it in the boot, you know what I mean? Because if they're pulling it beside me, you know what I mean, they might think, oh, I'm tampering with the stuff and rear, tear, 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 tear. So if they've got something to, they want me to deliver, I'm called delivering it. I'll stick it in the boot, and then on the other side, when somebody else picks it up, I mean, when they come out of their building, I'll open the boot, and they take their goods, and away they go, you know what I mean? So... What I don't want is a bomb, yeah, yeah, in the back of my car, yeah. Not only is it going to blow my car to shreds, yeah, but it's going to have me looking like a hot mess, yeah, if I even survive, right? So, um, yeah, it's a word of warning, man. Just be on your P's and Q's when you're picking up um, parcels, man. If you're delivering things for anybody, man, ask them. Hey, it don't cost you nothing to ask them what is in the in the package, you know. If it's a, if it's a bag and the bag's open, you can look in the bag, you know what I mean, with the person. You know, like, oh, some shoes and a dress for my wife or... I mean, my mate left his laptop at home, take it to the office, tear, 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 you know what I mean? But if it's some sealed parcel, like this one here, I mean, you better know what you're doing, you know? You ain't going, you ain't going nowhere with no parcel in there, and I don't know what's in the parcel, you know? You know what I mean? You better open up, you better have that parcel opened, yeah, and have some sellotape to reseal it, you know? Otherwise, I'm not taking it, yeah? So, if you're a private hire driver, know what you're doing, yeah? Don't go and kill yourself you know trying to make that extra 10 pound 
<laughs> you know what I mean? Ask questions, you know, you know what I mean? It might save your life one time, you know, and your partner's going to be really happy that you did ask those questions. You know, you might even get a little medal, you know, you know what I mean? You know, you know the Queen might give you a little medal, you know, you know what I mean? For exemplary services to the private hire industry. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, watch these parcels coming through, man, you know what I mean? In this... In this state of terror, you know, in the UK, you know, you know what I mean? You got people with some ganon, some madness, man, trying to kill everybody, you know? you know what I mean? And they're gonna want to kill you as well. So, um, yeah, be on your P's and Q's, man. You know what I mean, know what you're doing. Be safe. Happy driving. It's the Gig Guy London, signing out. Peace.